What is going on guys? We're back with another video today and it's the final draft video of the day most likely and it's the Packers trading up to 26 and I will have a reaction once the pick is in. Gotta be queen. Could be a wide receiver. Might even be a QB but we'll find out now in a moment. And the pick is Jordan Love. Um... So, I've seen a lot of people mocking him to the Packers at 30. Uh, I think the Patriots, a lot of teams thought, you know, people thought the Patriots are going to go for him, but obviously they traded back. A guy that I think is a little early for the Packers, Rodgers, to be fair, is getting on the older side. However, if he expects to play till 40, are you re-signing Jordan Love then? Are you going to be paying this man... Aaron near I mean, maybe about 10 mil less than Aaron Rodgers to play without even knowing if he's good or not I mean I get practice is practice but I feel like this is a bit early this is probably a year or two early to be honest and for a team that was so close last season I don't know if they just have some sort of future prediction that Rodgers is going to get hurt or he's going to retire even earlier than he thinks which to be fair I have said that there is a chance that the next few years he could be gone I mean unless that's the case why are you taking a QB when you have a glaring inside linebacker need you replaced Blake Martinez who was terrible with Kirksey who's shown he's decent but he's also shown that he can not even finish just about half a season over the span of two seasons your number one middle linebacker becomes Oren Burks if Christian Kirksey gets hurt. And Oren Burks had a season-ending injury last season. By far the worst inside linebacker position in the league, starting position in the league, without the injury. <laughs> With it, I don't even want it. I don't even want to begin to think about it. Queen is there and you don't take him. Wide receiver, I mean, at that point, I I don't think best available is even close to wide receiver at 26. But you take QB when you just were... I know we got smoked a bit by the Niners, but you were a maybe, honestly, a little bit better linebacker play away from the Super Bowl, and you take a quarterback who might not start for four years. I don't... I like the upside, Jordan Love, a guy that seems to have all the raw skills and is missing on the decision-making, but is Rodgers even the type of guy to teach him? I mean, especially if all these things are true or Favre supposedly never taught Rodgers, would that not carry even after all these years to Rodgers, who has even a worse ego? Not even worse ego than Favre, because there's just no one even close to as bad as an ego in the NFL, specifically at that talent range than Aaron Rodgers, would he really help Jordan Love learn so then he can replace him sooner? I mean, this... I like the idea. I just don't know if I actually like the pick. I mean, I, it, it could have been worse. Could have been a worse QB. Could have been a super reach or something, but... Man, I think it should have been Queen. I, I don't see why it wasn't. I don't get it. I mean, you've got other years for QB. I mean, unless Rodgers, like we said, gets hurt or decides to call it in early, this man might not even ever play a snap for Green Bay, like a starting snap. He might not. He might leave in free agency the same time Rodgers does. I mean, just, just I don't like it. I, I If Rodgers is a few years older, maybe. But in the league now where guys are able to play into their 40s, this is too early let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Maybe the Packers make a, a day two trade up, which I highly and you know I highly doubt because of the trade up we already made, losing a fourth round, which isn't a bad play, but for a QB it probably is because you don't you don't fix anything. You know you don't you don't get better taking Jordan Love. You don't get better, and that's what the team the Packers need to do by a decent bit, not a lot, but they need to get better. Wide receiver is still there. Linebacker is slowly fading here in the draft. It seems like another year where the Packers completely neglect linebacker. And hell, we might even see a freaking tackle in round two. If we see a tackle in round two, my confidence levels have reached just about zero in the, the organization. I mean, they seem like they're doing know what they're doing last year. This year, 
I think it's too much. I think a terrible decision. Uh, honestly, it's too early. It is. It's. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Like I said, probably the last video of the day. And then ultimately tomorrow we'll have probably a recap. Unless the Packers make an early trade up, I probably won't make a video on it until after the day two is over. And then we'll have a day three as well. But that's pretty much that. Unless I decide to go over every draft pick, which to be honest, it was pretty expected. This was one of the most tame drafts I've ever watched. Anyways, if you did like, maybe leave a like, subscribe, whatever. For all your draft content and, you know, draft rebuild, I suppose, tomorrow. But anyways, hopefully you come back for next video. But until next video, see ya!